in the north quarry of Bharatpur open cast mine of Mahanadi Coal Fields Limited, three coal seams were being worked on in a vertical sequence. These were seam 4, seam 3 and seam 2. As the seam 4 and seam 3 had already been worked out, the work in the lowermost seam 2 was still in progress. While the work was still on in seam 2, the coal barrier was left against the old overburdened dump to arrest the slush and accumulated water. This barrier was standing tall since September 2018. Scene 2 has been worked in four phases. Phase 1, Phase 2, Phase 3 and Phase 4. Working of Phase 1 was nearest to coal barrier and working of Phase 4 was farthest to coal barrier. When working of Phase 1 of coal scene 2 reached up to a depth of 8 to 10 meters. And some vertical cracks were noticed in the barrier while in operation. As a result, the work was discontinued but a close and continuous monitoring with the survey pillars was on for the strata movement and no remarkable movement was detected. Work was again resumed after 20 days and continued for one year to the date of accident in which there was no remarkable strata movement and instability of slope noticed. The entire patch of 390 into 360 meters was safely decoled. On the 23rd of July 2019, Work was underway in the left out ramp at the coal floor that is the lowermost part of the high wall about 140 meters away from the left out safety barrier in the opposite direction. Everything was on track at Bharatpur OCP. After a smooth run of the first shift, the second shift supervisor, senior overman and workman inspector mining confirmed that there was no symptom of any kind of movement in the coal barrier during their shift till 9 p.m. While the third shift approached, the deployed surface miner, four payloaders and 22 tippers commenced the work of coal extraction. All of a sudden, around 10.30 pm, the left out coal barrier retaining the old OB dump opposite the work site collapsed. The massive boulders of coal barrier with muck and debris immediately after the incident. The information regarding the accident was flashed to all key mine officials and headquarters. At the time of accident, 13 persons were present on site, which included one surface miner operator, four payloader operators, five tipper operators, one supervisor, one pump khalasi, and one security guard. Out of 13 persons, only nine could manage to escape and were ultimately rescued. Unfortunately, the remaining four persons, including a driver, a supervisor, a security guard, and a pump khalasi got trapped and buried under the flowing debris and muck. It is apparent that the presence of horizontal joint planes of weakness across the coal measure strata and some vertical cracks had reduced the strength of the left out coal barrier over the period of time. As a result, the barrier couldn't withstand the lateral thrust over the inside wall on the floor of scene 2. Moreover, the force exerted by the water which could not be drained out added further pressure on the coal barrier. Although physical monitoring was in place with no movements detected, the actual cause of the accident can be determined after the detailed scientific study.